Somerville authorities are investigating a disturbing case of animal abuse involving a dog. News 2's Berkeley County reporter Raymond Owens has more. Well, people aren't really upset because he pleaded guilty. They're upset because he ended up receiving a 30-day sentence. Rico was a Great Dane that lived near Somerville in Berkeley County. Valiant Rescue, a rescue organization that took Rico in last year after he was abused, said he was emaciated and weak with open wounds and a broken skull. Trey Phillips pled guilty to ill treatment to animals last week. He was given 30 days in jail as part of the deal. It was part of a plea deal negotiated by the solicitor's office. Stephen Futerall is a lawyer with Futerall and Nelson in Mount Pleasant. He wrote a book on animal law in South Carolina. He said there may be reasons a plea deal had to be reached. And it may be that they got reports and accounts from third parties. It's not as if law enforcement witnessed these events itself. You have a dog, obviously, as the victim that can't speak for itself, etc. So we may never know whether there were problems improving the case. There may have been other people in the home who could have abused this animal, things of that nature, which may have made it difficult uh, to prosecute. And indeed, a source close to this investigation did tell me that witnesses would not cooperate, and therefore they had to go into that negotiation to the plea deal. In Monk's Corner, I'm Raymond Owens. Count on two.